Okay. Hey everyone, it's Dominique here at Talent Commercial Arts. We've been going over the side of the window techniques, and today we're going to move on to number four, the Chudan Haraguke, or uh, I know our dojo would call it the fan block. So we're going to use the side on the extended side today. It's, uh, we use it as an extended core for our technique. The fan block comes across. Our intention with it usually in our classes when we're practicing with a partner is to um, evade and block a ski that's coming at us and then also see if we can catch it and then move it to attack. So to do that, I extend out the side. I like to think of it as starting at one side of my hip and then it's going to come across in front. I want to actually make sure that the middle section here covers uh, my, my face just a little bit, also my neck, because they could be poking at my neck. So I want to make sure I do block that area. When you're using this block, you want to have the right angle, because if it's straight, if it's completely flat, you're going you're gonna to miss it. You're going to miss that poke coming at you from the bow. Um, and then even if it's straight up, it's going to be a little bit too late. The bow's going to have too much power and it's going to get you even if the, you make contact. So you got to get a little bit more of a 45 degree angle. Just like as it's uh, pointing at their eyes, just as it's passing by. And then that's when you catch it. Good. At the end of this technique, you make contact. You have to turn the side almost like it's pointing at the floor and that's how you're going to get part of the, the capture. The other part is it's pointing down but then I'm also turning my wrist so then this part right here would actually be walking in and grabbing the bow or whatever got caught in there. So see if I can get a couple this way for you guys. Comes across, it's going to start to point down and then I gotta turn my wrist back. The end posture is almost just like a, a normal middle block, but pointing down. Now, with this technique, I do like to reach a little bit. That's my preference. It's not something I, I don't remember being told to do, just something I got in the habit that I found worked for me. So I catch, lock it in. Now, at that point, maybe I'm moving out of the way but that's when I got to be moving in to get to that middle block posture. So I'm getting out of the way, locking, catching, but this is too far away to lock it in. So once I have that bow, I have to move in. So that's what I feel like I'm doing when I'm working with a partner. When you are practicing the side hold drill, I know you can, you should be practicing it with a forward stance. If you do it that way, there's also nothing wrong with doing cat stance. It just happened more in the kata in a cat stance. And maybe your dojo does it differently, that's okay. I just want to practice kobudo. Thank you guys for watching. That is our middle uh, fan block, our Chudan Variety UK. I hope you guys are doing well and able to practice at home. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.